Hey there folks, Nick here, welcome back to Cricket19, I'm glad you could join me today for this beautiful T20 club cricket match out at the Chukra Exhibition Ground. Let's head straight down to the field and see how we go. Here we are at the beautiful Chukra Exhibition Ground, I actually like this ground, it's, it's nice, you've got some mountains and such, not, you know, a freeway overpass like, um, yeah, there we go, Kingma has been made the 12th man now, cop that Kingma. Uh, left Miguel Wayland in because, well, that last match went well. Oh, Shizen, we got an 86% chance of rain. That's not brilliant. Probably want to bat first. If we win the toss. So let's head down to the middle. We get to see my sexy shades. Uh, we failed on heads, so let's... Okay, I've gone with heads. I was actually going to hit tails, but it doesn't give you long. Oh, God, I've lost twice in a row. Oh, well, at least that's only the second loss. That's the only second loss that this team has had with me as captain. So I'll take that. Oh, look, and they've given us the bat. They must have heard me. I wonder if they can hear you. Probably not. Because I would imagine most people don't play this game with a microphone attached. Yeah, so here we go. McKnight and Lars out there in the middle. Look at me. Moved up to number six. I'm not sure that I want to be number five yet. Um, especially after a three in the last match. The rain is coming down already. That's not fantastic. Let's have a look and see at the first ball. Ooh, big swing. No runs, though. Fair enough. Uh, the match has already been shortened to 19 overs, by the looks of things. Uh, it doesn't look like I'm going to get a... Oh, I am going to get a bat. Am I? Did someone go out on the last ball? Here I come, averaging 42 almost. 18.4 um, from 19. So there's two balls left in this match. I don't know where any of the fielders are. Yeah. What the hell? What the absolute hell? What the... Look at how angry I am! Look at how angry I am! Wow! I have never seen a, an animated character that angry. That was awesome. I mean, awful, because I went out for a freaking golden duck. Um, so that's the end of the match, too. There isn't even going to be the last ball of that over, and it's been shortened to 15 for for them. That's not ideal. Let's have another look at that awful freaking situation. Far out. Oh, 144 runs, 15 overs. They've pretty much got to hit 10 runs and over. Stop showing me that! I don't want to see it anymore. Don't tell me it's going to show it to me again now. Jeez, all right. Out come Isaac Foster and uh, the other batsman for Knox. Oscar Ellison is going to bowl the first over. Let's just zip. Oh, okay, I get the third over, do I? Robert Lawson is uh, not the other opening batsman. Oh, jeez, we've taken wickets like crazy. Uh, it's a soft pitch or softer than Mildura, so we're going to bring it right up. Straight off the bat. And I'm not sure I love having a first slip in, but oh, let's see what happens. Because as far as I'm concerned, the wicket keeper can do anything the first slip can do. I usually put in a third or fourth slip because that way you've got wicket keeper taking care of first slip and third slip taking care of second and fourth. And then you've got your gully usually taking care of you know, fifth, sixth and you know, those shots. That's my theory on field of placement. Uh, let me know in the comments what your thoughts are. Uh, do you think I'm stupid? Do you think that sounds dumb? I don't know. You tell me. But I think there's really not much point. So let's let's do a field change here. So, right, we've got Oscar Ellison mid off. I can live with that. Deep mid on. I'm going to bring him up into mid on. Uh, Malian Williams with cover. Yep, not bad. I can actually, no, let's bring him in a bit closer. Let's bring him to short cover. Just something a bit different. Mid wicket, that's fine. Live with that. 
Uh, the guy at Backward Point, Grayson Richards. You know what? I'll leave you there for the minute. We can review in a sec. Uh, Preston Robson, square leg, get good position. Uh, the guy at Deep Fine Leg, I'm actually going to bring him up to Short Fine Leg. Um, first slip, yeah, ridiculous. Let's put you at number three. Uh, deep third man, I'm going to... What will I do with you? Where's where is there an obvious gap now? You know what? Square gully. It's that damn shot that they always play. Yeah, so this is the kind of field I like. Bit dangerous, bit of pressure, um, and you know, takes care of the shots that they tend to do that, that get away from me. So there we go, we'll apply that. And uh, see how now I've got kind of a bit of a gap between... Uh, I, think, I guess the gap between there is getting pretty big now. Um, ah, whatever. Let's see what happens. Short. Outswing. Fast. Oh, come on! That was, oh, that was diving distance, surely. That's what I've got the short cover there for. All right, let's try that again. Short. Fast. Outswing. Yeah, good work, mate. Good fielding. Short, slow outswing. Just for something different. This is the court behind ball. Wait there. Or the hit it short cover ball. Uh, final ball of the over is going to be that, 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 and that. Oh, tries to absolutely wallop it. Goes nowhere. It's a maiden in a T20 match. Believe it, folks. Not one of those balls was on the stumps. <laughs> I guess the point wasn't really to put the balls on the stumps. It was just to get the ball moving around and get him worried. Barker, still out there. Oh, let's try some in-swing. Right Back to me. Thank you very much. So we're an over of out-swing. We're now going to have an over of in-swing just to see, you know, what these guys want to hit. That's why we have the guy at square. Beautiful. Just having a chat to the umpire there. Hey, mate, how you going? Yeah, not bad. Looking forward to a pie after the game. Yeah, I'm looking forward to a beer. It's going to be a good one. Yeah, I'll see you out there after the game. Beautiful. Oh, i got a ball to stop here. All right, here we go. Oh! I bet Barker's butthole clenched then. All right, we'll give him a fast one now. Persisting with the in-swing. Oh, edged! Someone catch it! Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. All right. Last short in-swing. Edged! Got him! There it is! <laughs> Barker is gone and I've taken a wicket. Thank you very much. Oh, don't... Don't you love it? Fan bloody tastic. You are a legend, Marcus McKnight. So Josh Barker on his way back to the pavilion on five. I bet he's not pleased with that. I bet he's not pleased at all. Messiah White, once again, the Messiah for Knox, perhaps. I don't know. We'll find out. Oh, sorry, Echuca. We're playing Echuca. Why do I keep saying Knox? 111 runs from 61 balls. Uh, so that's not going to happen. Uh, so let's concentrate on just picking up wickets for maidens. Because that's a wicket maiden. And uh, two maidens so far in the match. So I'm one for naught. Carter Allwood is uh, in the wickets as well. I mean, it's no one for naught, but you know. So fast and outswing for the uh, left-hander. Played straight to the fielder at short cover. Beautiful. How about we go another fast and outswing for the left-hander? Oh, it's a thi- Oh, come on! There we go. That's my first runs of the match. And it comes after 14 balls. 13 balls, even. 14. I know what I'm talking about. Alright, fast and outswing for the right-hander, then. Yeah, yeah. 
Ooh, that's a confident shot. Well played, Wellington. Picking up two at least. Yeah, I thought about the third, but not quite. Not quite. Not quite. How about an in-swinging Yorker? Let's see what you do with that, Mr. Wellington. Yeah. Ooh, it's in the same area. You cheeky bugger. Another two. I guess they really need to be getting two runs and over two runs of ball at this point. Um, so yeah, that's a thing. Wait on. No, no run there. One ball left in the over. I haven't really bowled to a plan in this over. So and and of course there's been runs, which makes it difficult to bowl to a plan. Um, so I'm not sure what's going to happen here. Alright, top ball. I can live with that. Five runs in the over. A bit expensive. Um, but uh, way less than the run rate that Echuca need to be at. Some real variety there. Outswing and inswing. Believe it or not. So the current run rate, they're expected to get to 86. That's nowhere near enough. Ooh, straighten the body. Lawson cops it hard. So that is the end of the match. And Oh, you're bloody kidding me! One by six wickets? How? Oh, I know how. Because... Hang on. They didn't win. They didn't win at all. Alright, okay, so someone in the comments has to tell me how exactly it is that Echuca won this match. Okay? Please, tell me. And, and I'm actually going to put this bit in the start of the next video as well, because a lot of people don't watch till the end. Someone tell me in the comments how Echuca won this match. So, not a lot changed. Uh, didn't hit any fours, of course. Uh, bold one or two made overs. Two made overs, so that's the thing. And obviously no sixes either because I uh, only batted for one ball. And I got a point for shot making. Really? Really? That's that's like rubbing salt in the wound. Cool. Anyway, thank you very much for tuning into this episode. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like button. Um, I, I, I Honestly, apart from the wicket, the wicket was awesome. The mains were awesome. Uh, that final over sucked a little bit. And losing the match, I don't, again, I don't know how we lost that match. We, we won it. Ooh, cool. It's not the end of the episode yet, because the scouts from the T20 Challenge are watching me play. That's awesome. Um, so, yeah, that's the thing. Thanks for watching anyway, guys. Uh, we'll have a quick look at Selection status. Uh, so we're getting attention for JLT. We're getting attention, and we're a fair way off the T20 State Challenge now. No one else gives a crap about us still. Uh, but slowly, slowly, we're getting the attention, and we will be there soon. So thank you very much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I've said that about five times. I suck at outros. Um, yeah. Thanks for tuning in. I will see you tomorrow. Chairs Club. Oh.